Thanks. All right, Patrick Rogers, two under 68. Patrick, two rounds in the 60s, off to a good start. Talk us through your round today. Yeah, I'll definitely take uh, two two rounds in the 60s at a U.S. Open. Um, that's what we talked about yesterday after the round. Just to, to get it in the red was really huge um, with a great birdie on 18. And then um, I was a little scrappy yesterday, and I just wanted to be sharper, um, put the ball in the fairway a little more, hit the, hit the ball in the middle of the greens, kind of plod my way around, and I did an awesome job of that today. Um, it was as stress-free of a, of a U.S. Open round as, as you can have probably. Um, it's a f- fabulous golf course, and it's, uh, it's a, a great challenge to try to navigate. Yeah, was it a tale of two nines out there as far weather-wise? It seemed like it was a little windier in your your first nine, and then it eased up a little bit in the second. Yeah, it was great. I think we, we all expected it to be really windy um, all afternoon, and uh, we got kind of a mix of conditions. But um, for sure, once the, the storms came through, it was really beautiful out there and, and definitely scorable. So I tried to take advantage of that. Um, it's always a kind of a balance of being patient but taking opportunities when they come. And I did a really nice job of that the last nine holes and find myself right in the thick of it. Yeah, obviously you're in a great position. What are you going to do over the weekend to replicate that and try and take this thing home? Yeah, I've been fortunate that uh, I've had a few experiences at the U.S. Open. Um, I've I've played well in the first couple of rounds at at each event, getting a little better each time. And uh, I'm really going to try to draw on that experience. It's just... It feels like a U.S. Open is more rounds than a normal golf tournament. So uh, there's just so much that can happen, um, good, bad, or indifferent. But, um, yeah, there's just uh, so many things that, that go on over the course of the weekend. And I think at times my immaturity has, has lost a little patience, um, you know, trying to, to force the issue a little bit um, on Saturday and Sunday, uh, specifically in the Open. And so I'm going to try to do the same thing that I've been doing. Um, I know it's going to feel like a a really great opportunity in a big stage, but uh, this is what you play for. Yeah, talk a little bit about the crowds out there today and what are your expectations for this weekend? It probably is going to get a little rowdy. Nothing beats a Boston crowd. Um, You know, we love coming to the Northeast. I think a Northeast U.S. Open um, is really special regardless of where it is. And obviously there's a lot of history here and and Boston fans are really great. And so they've they've given me a great reception. I know the the feature pairings, they're they're really supporting and it's great to play in this environment. It's uh, it's really, really fun. Feels meaningful. All right, great point, Patrick. Thanks. Thank you.